Right, so Group F, last group at last. Feels like we've been here for hours, <laughs> uh, days, weeks. Portugal. Um, this this is one of the more straightforward groups, I would say. Uh, well. I, I don't know about that. You know, no, 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 I, 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 yeah. I don't think Portugal are that good. I think Austria are. Well, a lot of people are saying that they're potential um, dark horses. Um, I think Austria will win that group. Okay, they are two to one to win the group. They're five to one on to qualify. Portugal are favourites. They're nine to ten to win the group. One to nine to qualify. Iceland eleven to two to win the group. Four to six to qualify. Yeah, I, I, and, Iceland will qualify. Too. Um, Hungary ten to one and five to four to qualify. Who are Portugal even got? Like, I mean, they, they, they're, they're, they're looking at Ronaldo, but after that, Ricardo like, Carvalho. I mean, is, yeah, is, is Nuno yeah, Gomes still looking at Ronaldo? Paulina. There's a lot of the pop-up every two years, yeah. these guys. Nanny. But, yeah, Nanny, Nanny really actually yeah. is there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but um, I don't know, I think Portugal are one of those teams that are like, we're looking at them on reputation. Well, exactly. And I, I, like, when was the last time you remember Portugal put in a good tournament performance? Yeah, but they do have the best player in the tournament. Who might be, mightn't be fully fit, always needs a team structure around him to really be his best. So I don't know, like, he, like he, Ronaldo hasn't exactly ripped up any international tournaments since 2004. But, or 2006 to be fair, maybe. Okay. Well, if Portugal aren't as good as we think they are, who's going to knock England out in the quarterfinals? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Belgium. These are the real questions. Yeah. Okay, so Austria at the top of the group might be worth the bet then. That's yeah. two to one. Two to one, yeah. You yeah. fancy it? No, well, no. I want to because I want to go bigger on Austria. Uh, okay. What are they to get to the semis? Do we have that? <laughs> we'll, we'll, come, we'll come back to that. Uh, reach the semis are 20 to 1. Okay, right. Well, I'm going to go 30 euro on that. Ooh, all aboard the Alaba bandwagon. Yeah. Wow. Nice. And um, I have a bet from this. Okay. It's a real outsider bet. I'm going to put 10 euro on it. Yeah. Guilty Sigurdsson to be top goal scorer. Right. That is a really outside bet. I don't think I even have odds on 150 that. 150 to one. Oh, he's checking it out. 150 to one. Right, I'm okay. prepared for this. So 150 to one in Sigurdsson. You want one of those four goals wins it for your tournament? Yeah. Th I, score presume, I, three presume, kicks. I presume if a load of players get three goals, you share Two against the odds. With the odds. Yes. Yeah. It's a pretty good bet. It's, it's a great bet. How much you put on Tenor. Tenor. Okay. Cool. 150 to one. Okay, so that's the group. So I think we all think that um, Austria and Portugal will go through despite what we think of Portugal, which isn't much. And that Iceland might squeak through as the third place team because of how bad hungry we are. So that's what we're looking at. There's some bets to come out of it. We're going to have a quick look at the overall tournament now. And you guys have both got a good few bets to still make. Give it a lash with Ladbrokes.